Have a good day. I love y'all. Oh. Love you too. Ooh. Okay, guys. I haven't checked back in a bit. It's like noon. I'm going to take these towels off. I have eight towels to hang up and there's stuff in the dryer. And I brought that hamper out this morning. That's all Mally stuff. <sighs> she can fold it if I don't fold it. Whatever. I don't care, but I need to hang these up now. Ooh, okay guys, I'm in town now. I just got here. My friggin' seat belt. I had a fight with it to try to get it to move. Anyways, I'm going to the dollar store to get a birthday card. And then I'm going to go over to pick up the kids from school. And we'll go to the rink and etc, etc. Alright, I'm at the rink. I got uh, Chase some Pringles. A six pack of those little 7-Up Pops. One of those. And a $10 Dollarama card. All right, guys, I tied, I think, eight or nine kids' skates, so my back is screaming at me. But they're all out on the ice now and then for an hour, and then they go up to, the, like, the upstairs warm room. There's a bunch of food and everything up there. But I'm so hot, I had to take my jacket off. Woo. All right, guys, there's somebody in that truck there looking over. But anyways, I'm at the Dollarama again in the Shoppers Drug Mart. I'm going to go in. It's just the first time I was here, I was in a rush. I'm going to pick up a couple of things, feminine care products and a few things. And I have to go to Shoppers. Um, and it's 4.11, so I need to be back over to the ring for 5 o'clock, which I have plenty of time, I think. All right, I stopped and picked up Mally. I dropped her to Sobeys. I'm here to get the kids. And then I'll go back and get Mally. That's his coffee. I think he went to the job anyways. <clears throat> All right, guys. I haven't checked back in a while. It's 8.29. And 30. my husband just got home. He went to town. Got me a coffee for tomorrow. I'm not drinking it now. I was not crying. My eye is bothering me. So he got some groceries. I don't know what he got, but I'm going to show you. A uh, big thing of oil. Must have been on sale. This oh. is from... Walmart. Mally's here making cookies. I'll show you after. They look beautiful. We got two more hamburger helpers, stroganoff. That was probably at Walmart. I don't know. We got some garbage cereal, but the kids love it. So, this is a new box. Apple cinnamon Cheerios. My sister makes my heart happy. Um, cereal. We're out of cereal. So, there's something. Um, we got a bag of sour cream and onion chips. Some eggs. Yippee. I know we went to Superstore too, so this stuff is probably from Superstore. Or, God, two things of eggs. Some ketchup chips. That's no. Loads of ketchup. Oh, some chocolate ice cream. <laughs> it's chocolate. Oh, he got some cheese. We were completely out of cheese, so this is good. It doesn't matter. He got some Activia uh, strawberry yogurt. Get out of there. Some lettuce. Great. It's nice to get some fresh vegetables in the house. Yippee! Uh, cucumber. It's probably like $4 or something. It's ridiculous what things like that cost these days. Okay. I don't think it was that much, but it's expensive. We got hamburger. Yeah, this is from Superstore. Eight oh four dollars a package for this package. It's $8.80 a kg. Ooh. 804 and 843 Wow. Hamburger. Um, oh. Two taco kits. Yippee. So, two suppers. Two separate suppers. They're the ones with the soft shell and the hard shell. We got some lettuce. Maybe we'll have that this weekend. Yippee. We haven't had tacos in a while. Some salsa. Yippee. This is from Walmart. Maybe the tacos are from Walmart. I don't know. Some salsa. Oh, he put a jug of milk in the <laughs> in a bag. Some milk. Of course, it's, no, that's Violet. 
Um, seasoning, garlic onion, onion, and garlic powder. Okay, you gotta pass me that bag over there. You got some pizzas, so the casa, casa de mia, casa de mama. Same thing. That's a Hawaiian one. This is a three meat one. You don't need to come down in the middle of the night, night and make it. A deluxe now. one's mine. <laughs> a deluxe one, another three meat one. These must have been on sale. And another three meat one. These will all go directly in the deep freezer, which is great. And I can't, I can't pick that up. My back, my back is hurting. I'll drag it over. He got a full case of mini raviolis. Yippee. They don't eat this all the time. This will last quite a long time. And then a full case of alfagetti. Yippee. So that's good because um, sometimes I do heat them up and put them in kids' lunches or if they are hungry between meals or if there's storm day. A storm day, that's right. You know what I mean? It's good to have something like this. And he said they were 87 cents a can, which that's incredible. It hasn't been that low. That was probably at Walmart. That's a dollar hasn't a been can. That low in months and months and months and months and months that we've noticed, anyways. So I think that's everything. Yeah. That's everything. So I need to put this stuff away. So there's a grocery haul for you for today. But I'll show you Mally's cookies after because they look amazing. Good morning, friends. It's Tracy from Nova Scotia Living Arts the next day. I am just feeding Violet and Boar's breakfast, but I went out, took these guys for a walk. And I swear I was like a Disney princess. There was pheasants out there. Timothy was out there. The Blue Jays were out there. The Sparks were out there. The uh, Randalls were out there. And they, well, the pheasants didn't follow me, but the crows and the Blue Jays followed me on my walk. Like 20 Blue Jays. The pheasants were out there when I first came outside. But they flew away. They're big chickens is what they are. But I put a whole bunch of food out there and they were waiting for me. It's only like seven o'clock in the morning. I don't know why they were all waiting for me now. But Morse Day in the time and Morse's two other cousins are there. So he's going over to the tree. There's stuff there too. <laughs> awesome. And then these two are eating their breakfast. Today is Saturday morning. I really just got back from a walk and I left those guys outside when I went to get stuff for um, my friends outside. Just making myself a coffee. But once I fed them, I came in and fed these guys. It's 7.41 now, so yeah. Now we got up around quarter to seven, not, not super early, but yeah. Anyways, hockey today. I brought some toys down from the attic. <laughs> Can you pull them? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Mace had his breakfast. He has his hockey underclothes on. Thank you.
great. The friggin' rink parking lot's full. We had to back into the spot, but Randall and Herbie were there to help guide me in, so. Oh, perfect. Thanks, guys. I can always depend on you. All right, we had to park way the hell I heck up here, but that's all right. Oh, it's a beautiful day. It's warm out. It's like it's not plus three or something like that. But after hockey practice, we're going to go do a couple errands, and then we're going to Papa's house for lunch. I brought some hot dogs and hot dog buns from the house. And then we're going to come back to the rink because there's a CTV hockey game, like adults. you got to pay to get in. Maze will get in free because he has a jersey, and his name's, if he wears his jersey, his name gets entered into a draw, and he might win half of his hockey registration next year off. So that would be fantastic because that's going to be like $800 or something, $700, $800. So we'll see. <clears throat> but we're going to hockey practice now. And yeah, we'll be, home, we'll be in town till probably 3 o'clock or something today. Today is Marquise's birthday too. <laughs> that's the most important thing. I'll have to send him a birthday message. Oh, under nine, room one. Oh. All right, there he goes. Oh, here comes a little squirt. <laughs> he was a little squirt niche. When it's a little more enjoyable. All right, he's out there. All right, these guys are just doing exercises. I just messaged Dad to say there's hockey and gave him a breakdown of our plan for today. So I don't know if he'll come over now or what. You never know with that fella. Right, Mies? Yeah. Well, that guy looks like he came from Jurassic Park Island. Oh, here they go. All right, he's in that second group over there. Oh, he didn't fall, but see number 10? There he is. Oh, he passed, he's in the lead. He's coming over to this circle. He's Speedy Gonzalez. Andale, andale. <laughs> Misha's grinning. <laughs> there he goes. I did not just miss him. Did I just miss him? No, he's right there. Oh, and he got it in. Good. I see Papa. He just came in. He's standing by the boards. Right there. Here he comes. <laughs> He's trying to find Maze. Where's Maze? I lost track of him now. No, that's not him. No, he's over there. You can tell by the way he's standing. That's him right there. <laughs> I didn't know if he just pushed that boy down or not. Yeah. Here he comes. Do it! Do it! <laughs> Slide down! <laughs> He's over on the other side. He's over on the other side. So you got my message. Alright, I'm in the dressing room. They should be getting off the ice any second now. I just come down when there's one minute left so I can get here so I... I don't know. It's just my crazy mind. Get down here so I can be ready and tear all this stuff off and be out of here as soon as possible. Dad, I told Dad we'll meet him over at his house probably in a half hour. I'm just going to the dollar store and going to shoppers, going to his house to make dogs, and then that's it. Then we'll come back over here and enjoy a grown-up hockey game. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Marquise. Happy birthday to you. I'm 
just at Mesa's Hockey. I'm waiting for them to get off the ice. They should be coming here any second now. And I just wanted to make sure I saying you happy birthday because I love you so much. To you, Uranus, I'm back. All right, I just sang Marquis a happy birthday song and sent it to him. <laughs> here in the dressing room. They're not here yet. They got done three minutes ago and they're not here yet. Usually they're tearing down the door. So they must be going over. There's a hockey game tomorrow in Yarmouth. Starts at noon. It's over an hour, a little over an hour away. I forgot about it. So we'll have to go down to that, which will be fine. But it's like, I've been to a rink Friday, now Saturday, tomorrow Sunday. You know, I'm tired. I'm tired, but it'll be fine. It'll be fine, Tracy. Fine, 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 very fine. All right. Oh, what a beautiful day. See, look at that parking spot right there. But it wasn't available when we got here. Oh, Misha's in the truck already. Randall's excited. Do you hear him? I did bring his jacket. He'll wear it when we come back to the game. Along with his jersey, so he gets in free and gets his name entered in that draw. Watch out, that car's barking up. Backing up, not barking up. Throw up. Wait. It's going around. Wait. All right. Okay. Everything's cool. We went to the dollar store and came out in the truck. I realized I forgot to go to the freaking bank machine, for goodness sakes. So they're out in the truck. I'm just running in. Okay. I got it. Ah, it's $10 for me to get in. $5 for me should get in. Maze gets in free if he wears his hockey jersey. So, $15. We got our goodies at the dollar store. And we're going to eat lunch before we go there. So they each got a drink, some chips... And I think they got like gummy, a package of gummies or something. I got myself a Diet Pepsi or a Pepsi Zero. And I'll just snack on some of their chips if I'm hungry, which I probably won't be. All right, where did I park? Up there. Okay, then we'll go over to Dad's now. Perfect. All right, we made it to Dad's. Oh, look up, the snow's pretty well all gone. Shut the door. No, what? shut it right. Does he not feel yeah, he's here. His no, car's he here. Isn't here. Isn't here. And the door's open. I didn't see his car. Okay. Everybody calm down. Yeah, calm down. All right, Misha. What? I got the bag of wiggly wieners here. Hi. You ready for some hot dogs, Dad? Oh, I'm ready for them, guys. You don't want no hot dogs? They're high quality ones. Huh? They're good quality ones. Okay. There. Yeah. Dad must have been doing his feet last night. Misha's doing her exercises over there. I, uh, Dad watching the news, of course. Nothing new there. And I just put some wieners in a pot to boil up. So, Misha wants three, she said. Maze wants two. Dad's having one. I'll have one. And, yeah, May, stop. Uh, Go sit in uh, someplace else. Anyways, yeah, I might have a cup of tea. I don't want one right now, but we'll see. All right, these guys are playing with Dad's old globe. Like, it even has, like, the USSR on it. Um, anyways, they like me to tell them places, and they have to find out. Gave Misha Argentina, she found it after a few minutes. Mays is looking for Zambia. He knows it's in Africa, but he's got to find Zambia. All right, there's the gourmet dinner. It's 11.54, so, yeah. We got the buns here. Misha got out the condiments. May's got out the... He drank all the juice. I know, there's more juice there. And we're just going to eat some hot dogs. <laughs> May's just wants ketchup. Misha's having the works. Yeah. There, then there's two in the pot for Papa. He's just getting his socks on. Delicious. I just notice Dad has, this is, I gave to him for Christmas. They're doing the big raffle draw today. March 2nd. He has one, two, three, 
four, five. And they're like big prizes, like fairly big prizes. I had all year to sell them. I'm too lazy to sell them. When you register a child for hockey, like we pay for, I think there's 10 in a book. So we pay a hundred bucks as part of the registration. And it's up to us to sell the tickets to get our money back. I'm too lazy for that, so I just give them out as Christmas presents. So, anyways, he got five tickets. $50 worth of tickets, but it wasn't because of the money issue. I just, like, I thought if anybody was to win. I gave some to my in-laws, but I hope he wins. I really hope he wins. I hope any of them win, but he just, I don't think he wins very much of anything, so it'd be awesome if you won. I'm gonna get across it very carefully. Don't friggin' fall in the water. That's including myself. <laughs> well, okay. okay, we got our bag of treats. I got Maze's winter jacket. Misha's got the money. He's got his toque. Has Sidney Crosby's name on it. Well, He's he number 87. Free, right? He gets in for free. Five dollars for you. Ten dollars for me. Oh, no, that's not mine. oh, that guy had the same jersey on. So, all right, we're good. We're good. Let me show you get up there and you can pay for us when we go in. All right, we're here a half hour early and it's starting to fill up already. So we were gonna sit here, but somebody already has a blanket there for goodness sakes. That's all right. Yeah, exciting. Oh, I had to walk back down there to get this. Maze is way over at the far end with a bunch of his hockey buds. Nisha and I are here locked and loaded with treats and a cowbell. Ooh, here's the pamphlet. So the doors open at 12. Team warm up at 1. Oh, Canada. Oh, Sarah Ojo Sullivan. She used to work at 4 Plus that Maze went to. Um, she's singing presentation and ceremonial puck drop first period at 1:30 intermission at 1:55 second period at 2:05 intermission big raffle draw third period at 2:50 3:20 game over and awards and presentations Graham Baxter Memorial Trophy Michael Ireland Memorial Trophy most valiant Vaughn Van Tassel Memorial MVP. Your admission ticket is put into a door prize. Keep it handy. It's in Misha's zipper pocket. And listen throughout the game for your number to be drawn. Um, all prizes must be claimed by the end of the game. Oh, they're coming out. I don't know which team is which. So there's CTV, No Stars, and Team 911, the Digby Fire Department, and the RCMP. So I don't know which is which has a shell gas station thing on their front of their jersey they must have sponsored it but just watching grown-ups play hockey they're so much faster than kids i mean kids are fast but look how much faster huh they look like giants this is going to be amazing and these aren't even high school kids these are adults like NHL adult people. They're not NHL people, but they are compared to me. Exciting. Oh, they just came up with some pucks to try. I think this is the Digby uh, Fire Department and police officers, because one of the guys is a hockey coach and he's a RCMP. So, this is the home team. Alright, there's a lot of people. Maze was way over there, but now he's way there. The pom-pom hat, that's him. Oh, the referees just came out. They mean business. Oh, they're lining up. This is exciting. What's going on? They gotta sing happy birthday. I mean, O Canada. <laughs> I keep saying happy birthday instead of O Canada. <laughs> it looks so official. Everything looks so official. There's still some people coming in. Maze is off gallivanting again. I said, if anybody tries to nab you, scream. 
fire and you're not my mom, you're not my dad and kick him right in the throat. There's a couple of the hockey coaches in Mazes League on this team. I see one, the police officer guy, right there, the one that, that, 21. He's the Poe, I believe. Uh, oh, Canada, I'll stand and please take off your hat. Oh, we gotta take off her hat too. The flag is this way to my left, your right. Oh, Just a special thank you to somebody who's been really close to the minor hockey organization and to this ring. And I've got it on pretty good authority that he's not quitting, but he's slowing down. So it's our main referee, Mr. Robbie Morgan. He's done this year, and uh, thanks for 50 plus years of service, man. Are they playing Red Rover? Oh no, they're just shaking hands. All right, it's just about to start. Let's see. Oh, there. Okay. Round, round. I'm gonna ring the bell for both teams. Holy cow! <laughs> just about hit the ceiling. You gotta ring it real loud, Mish. Oh, you missed it. Oh, go, 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 go. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Did it go in? Yeah. Ring it, ring it. Wow. <laughs> we gotta ring it loud, me. Oh, I didn't mean to do it. Somebody broke their stick. Hopefully they have an extra stick. The blue needs to hit down there. We need to get down there. Your coach Dave is on, is he? Oh my goodness, that goalie is on his toes. Holy cadiddle hoppers. Oh, go, go, go. Oh, nice try. Oh, good save. Oh, bring it. These games are three periods though, Maze. When you have a game, it's only two. These ones are three. But if our team gets it, bring it even extra loud. Like, if it gets in that net, go crazy. Caught it. They caught it, yeah. you got to have a good eye to be a goalie. I know, it hit his foot. He does have nice hair, doesn't he? Looks pretty cool waving in the wind like that when he's skating. Okay, go. Over. Let's go. 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 Oh. 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 Oh no. Oh. Uh oh. Oh. Good save. Good save. Yes. Oh. 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 Get it. Oh come on. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Oh. oh. Over, over, under, up and down. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. Come on. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh. I don't understand. On the other side, blue line. If the person goes before the puck, then it's offside. Yes. Okay, don't know if that's offside or ice. Yes! Oh, wow. Where did you get that? Oh. Mace went to the canteen, I didn't realize, and got a marker so he can get one of the players to sign his hat. <laughs> 
Oh, for goodness sakes. Oh. Oh my God, I'm about to have a heart attack. Oh, up and around. Is he gonna do it? Nope. Oh, 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 do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Oh, oh, good save. Zamboni's gonna come out. They're gonna go in for a break. There they go. There's the guy with the dreads. Mace is around here somewhere now. I hope you don't fall. Get out of the way. Here comes the Zamboni. I'm so glad I got treats before coming here because everybody's going down to the canteen now and no way. They got pepperoni sticks too, Slim Jims. Here he goes. Just realized. Go! He's going to get somebody to sign his. Do it! <laughs> he didn't know I was filming and then he's seen. He's gonna go ask a hockey player to sign his hat. I don't know. It'll be funny if he can find somebody. Oh, here he comes. Oh, he went back down. Look, look where he left it. There's pepperoni stick. I don't know if his was a Slim Jim or Misha's one. They both got dry pepperoni. I don't know. And the gummies. Oh, just a second. He's down there, wait. There's little hockey players down there. I think they're gonna go out and do like a little 10 minute skirmish or something. But he's waiting for one of the big hockey players. Allie. <laughs> okay, they have a few like little, like four or five year olds. I don't know what age. Under seven, I think. Uh, they're gonna do a little 10 minute scrimmage or whatever it's called. Apparently. They're just little. Smaller than Maze. Maze is a hip squeak. Just in case anyone is wondering, the first 40 door prizes have been drawn and the numbers are up here to your right. Down in the These are our tickets. This is for the door prizes. This is for when Mays wins half of his registration for free next year. Oh. Mays is right there. That's the hoe. Ask him. Right there. Get shy. <laughs> he is. He's gonna sign it. Isn't that nice? <laughs> That's fantastic. <laughs> oh, they're doing there. May's got two signatures. His coach. And that guy right there, he's a Poe too. There's two police officer signatures on his hat. Can I show them? They look like scriggles, but you know, what you're gonna do? It's a canteen marker and it's a hat. All right, the little ones are coming off, so the big ones will come back on. Don't fall. Oh my goodness, he almost did. All right. A 
have to open Mesa's pot. All right, we got a couple goals. Of course, I didn't get it on film, but we went crazy because it was for our team. Mays has the bell now. And he's ready to roll when it's time. Well, they're not going to be signing now. They're going to the dressing room, Mays. They're going to the dressing room. There they go. Oh, there's that guy again. Don't fall. Okay, they're doing the... the first th number is 001. Three, five, seven, six, nine. It's not us. It's okay. Somebody else lucky enough to win it. For a 50% off your hockey registration. The white ticket, everybody. Second number is 001. Oh, three, for heaven's five, sakes. Nine, nine. Gosh darn it. So, white numbers are nine, nine, one. To put that right in the bucket. Well, yeah, we're not doing those yet. Now the raffle. I don't. First one is painting with light. Oh no, I don't know. And it goes to Karen Churchill. The tickets that Papa has. All right. If a winner is not here, they will be notified. Okay, come on, Gerald. Gerald, Gerald, Gerald. Next is our 50 50 draw. Oh, we're not doing that. Okay, they brought at it again. It's 248. This gets done at 320. Well, they just had a dang penalty shot and I missed it, but they got it in. Somebody threw a hat up there and they have a hockey stick. Yeah! <laughs> What's going on? It's not a shootout because it's not a tie. Yay! Okay, Misha and Mays. Oh. Misha and Mays are going to go check the door prizes because they just announced there's 18 door prizes yet to be claimed. So we get two tickets when we came in for Misha and, May, uh, Misha and me. And anyways, they're going to go and see. I guess I won $50 at Superstore. Yeah, we won. <laughs> we were going to go there anyways. I have to get a few things for Misha's field trip on Monday. The game is all over. I'm just coming to get my kids. Oh. Okay, Mays. I need to get by here. I need to get by here, bud. Thank you. Oh, they're doing some awards. Woohoo! Is but I'm CGB news crew. Look at that little peanut. That's nice. That's nice. Down there. Oh, somebody's signing his hat. There. That's exciting. Oh, that must be his mom or his Grammy. He got another person. See, Maze has a big smile on his face. So 
okay. We'll be able to check our other ticket. You can make your way down there and go check that ticket. I'm just gonna wait on Maze. Maze, I'm gonna go over on that side. We got, there Maze, you take another one. Thanks bud. Oh. Ooh, it's gotten chilly. Remember we're parked up behind the vet. You got two. <laughs> well, that was a good hockey game, wasn't it? Got fifty dollars for the superstore. Yeah, I can pay with my card. Yeah. My superstore card. Wait, do you still want it? No. We're using it for the house. It. Okay. It was my ticket, but she paid for my ticket, so it's it's <laughs> Okay, watch out for the puddle. If you didn't know, over there, there's actual trail you can go over. Oh, there is. Yeah, well, what? I like to live off road. There's a trail right there we could have used. That's what I used last time. Right, hurry up, Mace. Yes, I need my charger. All right, I got a few things from Superstore. I spent $37 out of a $50, $50 card, so we still got a little bit left over, but we're going the high heck home now. I'm tired with a capital T. All right, it's 4.23. <coughs> we just got home. This is about $37 worth. I got two cases of water, which is out in the porch, two for $7, plus the bottle deposit on top of that. Strawberries for $3.49. Mally loves these roasted seaweed things. They were $1.49. I got a salad for Mally. Misha's field trip on Monday. I told her she could pick out a fruit or a melon or something. That's what she wanted. Um, I did get some sandwich meat. The ends. Um, Black Forest ham with maple. 50% off. It was $10.08. This was the cheapest one there. Um, it was $37.90 a kg. Oh my god. I got two sub buns. They were $1.79 because I don't need a whole bunch of them. And a bag of carrots. They were on sale for $2.99. And that's what I got. All right, guys. I Oh, there's those little forks we'll have to put in the fridge with the salads and stuff. Um, I got a pop box. So I'll show you. Well, actually, I have something in the dollar bag, too. Not much. I got two bags of Tostitos. I thought we might have nachos sometime this week. I got hamburger. Or maybe taco salad or just hamburger and whatever. Nachos. They were three, three twenty-five a bag. And I got me a pair of gloves. It's hard to find waterproof gloves. I don't think these are waterproof, but she's going to bring a few pairs of gloves on our skiing trip. I got this from Shoppers. It's sore throat lozenges and nasal congestion relief. I just got some for the house. Misha was starting to say she felt like her throat was getting sore. So oh. Oh, I got this at the dollar store too. It's just some medic tape. All right. The Papa Hall. Violet and Morris already got their little treat. They're off with that. There's barbecue chips. Oh, he's been busy baking. Papa's homemade Spanish donuts. Spanish ones. I don't know if I've ever had a Spanish donut. That's awesome. Some marshmallows. Violet, where's your treat? Did you get to Boris already? Huh? Some watermelon slices. Some fruit filled candies. Some chocolate bourbons, bourbons, bourbon, chocolate cream filled cookies. A oh, bunch of chocolate loonies. Oh. Some gummy bears bouncing here and there and everywhere. 
creamy caramels. A couple of these four fun bars. Some Bon Bon Boom lollipops. Some Oreos, not Oreos cookies. Some chocolate wafer cookies. Some chocolate sticks. And there's four of these little Diet Pepsis in here. So, one for each of the children. And now I have another one of his dang boxes. And he reinforced the handles with black electrical tape. He's such a smart guy. He must not have... Oh no, it's not duct electrical tape. tape, it's duct tape. It's gonna say it's red green. Anyways, that's it. My husband just put wood in the fire. I'm not doing anything for supper. These guys shouldn't be too hungry. There's probably stuff in the fridge. Misha's right there. <laughs> Anyways, it's been a good day, a busy day, a long day, but I'm so pumped. I won $50 for the Superstore, and I still have a little <clears throat> chump change left. So, anyways, and tomorrow's another hockey day, which is fine, but it's a lot of work. But I'm going to put this stuff away, and I'll check back in a bit. Well, hey, friends, this is me checking back in a bit. Oh, my goodness, Herbie brought some of his... There was just three seagulls out there with the Randalls. Hmm. Anyways. Yeah. Um, that was a good day. I know it's a, if you're not into hockey, it's probably one of those, not one of those videos you want to watch anyways. And that's fine. I do this because I enjoy doing it. And for memories for my family when I'm older, gray, and might not be here anymore. Whatever. That was a fun day. <clears throat> and it was like a fundraiser hockey game. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at that. Oh, Herbie. Poor Randall. They'll clear up anything, like, so fast, seagulls do. I didn't even see Randall fly away. They probably ate him, too. Anyways, yeah, the, um, it was a fundraiser, and that's the big thing at the end of the hockey season and stuff, and it's, uh, they've been doing it for years, apparently. And, yeah, it was good. It was good. So, anyways, I'm gonna say peace, love, and happiness today and every single day. Please like, share, and subscribe if you so choose. But if not, that's okay too. I still love ya. I still want all the happiness in the world for each and every one of you out there. I certainly do. I really, really honest and truly do. Yes, I do. So, okay guys, with that I'm going to say have a good night. Or have a good morning. And I will. See you tomorrow. Bye! Boink.